F122 is out now, and it is time to start our My Team Journey, the return of S2G Motorsports. All right, so in F122, you get to choose your entry point into the sport, whether you're a newcomer, a midfield challenger, or a championship contender. You get different budgets for, I think, each category. So as an entry point, basically no money. Like, yeah, we get no money. Midfield challenger gets us about 5 million, and championship contender gives us 10 million. Guys, I want this to be a bit of a grind so we're gonna go newcomer absolutely do we want to use the full season of formula one events i think so i think we want to do that we'll 100 percent do that and kind of want to customize the settings i'll let you know what i'm doing first of all the assist of how i'm gonna drive it's yeah we're not gonna have steering assist braking assist traction control on medium because i'm still pretty bad at this game medium still makes it tough you know uh we'll keep ers and drs something i gotta do myself to make it more challenging yep this is what we'll use guys i'm gonna start with 70 ai difficulty because i'm i'm a noob you guys know how chaotic i can get in f1 just just roll the clip for some of my carnage driving let's just see what happens we've kind of made up a few places bit of contact there i think we avoided damage but i'm spinning left and right and more damage how on earth is the car fine we surely can get this guy into points no horrific all right, boys, I've taken you through most of the settings. It's time to begin our My Team journey. Let's freaking do this. Oh, wait, we, we got an option. Use My Team icons. Once enabled, My Team icons cannot be disabled. They can only be recruited by player teams. Okay, now optional hires. We'll enable this, but we won't hire any of the My Team icons to start with. Maybe in the future we'll do that. Anyways, it's time to start our My Team journey. Let's go. All right, how do we want to look now? I'm going to spend a bit of time to get, get a bit of drip on my driver. Pretty Pretty sure I used this face for last year. So we're gonna just run that. Of course, guys, we're gonna call ourselves Cedinho Jr. Like, I mean, is there any doubt? Is there any doubt? Cedinho's journey in F1. Do I make Cedinho English or Brazilian? Considering it's Cedinho Jr., gotta rock Brazilian. Maybe we'll we'll show a bit of flair with our driving as well. The next Erton Senna, in my opinion. How do they not have Sid as a commentary name? It's a pretty common name, man. Come on, EA. What should our driver number be? I think I had 69 last year, but you know what? Probably not. Let, let, let's not do that. Let's not do that. Let's all be adults. A few moments later. Meh, we're gonna use 69. Why not? All right, now we gotta get a look for our driver. Okay, okay. Ooh, I like this helmet. Maybe don't. This, this is weird. Guys, I don't mind this look for my uh, helmet. Looks pretty good. We're, go we're gonna rock this. Why does this look like a Mercedes suit? Don't want that, 100%. I like this, but doesn't really go well with what we have going. I think this is much better. We'll, we'll rock this for now. We can, of course, change it later on. For the gloves, again, we'll go matching blues. Character poses. Um, okay. Okay, now. This is what Cedinho does. Let's go. Podium emotes. Yeah, you love to see that. Hammer time. Okay. Okay. We'll rock that. These are victory radio calls. Gonna be happening a lot, guys, in this series. Cedinho is the best in the business. Oh, Fast. <laughs> Fast. Is... We're gonna rock this one. Yep, 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 yep. All right, there's Cedinho made. Let's go ahead. Now we gotta name our team and everything. S2G Motorsports. Nice. What, what just happened wow. there? Some kind of no, no, I, I need to rename my team. Guys, I just named my team S2G. Where's the motorsports? Okay, I guess I'll have to just select sponsor first and then decide what team name and all I want. Okay, so let's see what we can do. Zenin Dynamics earn 15 Constructors Championship points in a season. Okay, now, okay. We get a gold bonus of 3.85, 4.6 million to start with. Echo gives us 4.5. As a team achieve two points, finishes during a season. That's possible, you know. No? Shy, finish 8th or better than the Constructors. That's a tough one. That is a tough one. 4.4 million. Monet Paris is an interesting one for that. Nah. We're going to do Zenin Dynamics. Because I, I feel like we can earn 15 Constructors Championship points. We can do this. We can. 4.6 million to start with. Perfect. All right. So we need Power Unit Supplier. Do I go with a Renault engine? A Red Bull engine? A Mercedes engine? Or a Ferrari engine? Ferrari's engine to take. Yo, this Red Bull engine's got to be better than they're showing. Like, Max Verstappen is P1 in the World Drivers' Championship. Red Bull are, like, miles ahead of everyone else. 
balance. Okay, so a bit out of date, you could say. I think I want to do a balance between uh, durability and performance. I think Mercedes is the bet for us. I know that engine in real life is a bit dodgy, but on this game, it looks decent. Plus, it's a bit different to the ones I've been seeing every other career mode F1 guy take. I saw Aravan uh, and um, uh, Mardik Motorsports take the Red Bull powertrains. So, um, yeah, I think I'm going to go Mercedes then. I think I'm going to do that. I'm going to go Mercedes engine. Why not? Let's do that. We do need to get a teammate now. We're going to go with the Mercedes engine, Zen and Dynamics, and now we need a driver. All right, boys, we now got to choose an F2 driver to our team. Who do we go for you? Ryan Nassani? Absolutely not. He's a bit of a meme. I do know that. Enzo Fittipaldi wouldn't be too bad, you know. Uh, Marino Sato. Nah, Jack Aitken. Nah, Liam Lawson. I think it's got to be Oscar Piastri. Fun fact, he's won F3 and F2 back to back. Still doesn't have a seat. S2G Motorsports is going to fix that. Good man. Okay, we're not happy with our team name. That's what we got to change. We got to put the motorsports in S2G. S2G Motorsports. There you go. We're back in business. I like this look of the car, you know. Not bad. We, we got to change it a little bit, though. Let's see. Ooh, what's this green one over here? Yo, this looks rad. This looks nice. What's this one? Ah, this 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 is a bit weird. It's kind of like shining. I like the look of the yellow in this one, which I can maybe go for a blue theme. Or maybe with this one. We, we got to figure out what looks good. This one was super nice, but you can't really change the color scheme on it. So I guess we'll go with this, but I'll end up changing some of the colors. Kind of like this, boys. Uh, we kind of look like uh, a bit of like the Williams, but that's fine. That's fine. We've got our sponsors, the number 69 on there as well. You'll love to see that. I think we're going to rock with this for now. This is going to be the car we've got. Uh, uh, yeah, for now, for starting, this is going to be the livery. We'll, we'll keep improving it as time goes. All right, let, let's, let's get to building a badge. I wish I could put the S2G logo on this. That'd be sick, but of course you can't. It is what it is. I think this is what we're going to do with our logo. It's a bit basic, but it'll work. Oh, there are some special logos over here. Maybe we'll change our logo in the next episode or something. For now, we'll rock with this. All right, boys, all the customization done. Time to begin our My Team journey. All right, boys, there's our car being revealed to the world. And we're going to have a chat with Will Buxton after. I'm ready for this, boys. I'm ready for S2G Motorsports to take over the world. Let's see. This isn't just about me. This is about my team and I'm behind them 100%. Together we're unstoppable. Absolutely. Let's do that. I'm just going to say we've seen what they can do on paper because they want F2 and F3. Yeah, making the car as responsive, uh, responsive as possible. So aero department's going to be happy with that. Let's go. It's going to be tough, but we'll have a better place after the first race. Best to stay that. Mm, we've developed an incredibly light car, I guess. Gonna, gonna give my aero department a nice boost by saying that. There you go. Will Buxton does talk a lot man no cap balancing act your team balance will inform you of the team's financial situation okay your sponsors will give you cash each week and extra bonuses when you complete the objectives resource points we know that they're used for r d and stuff like that we can earn them through fps and everything awesome awesome acclaim as your team completes at race we get to learn a claim great we, we know everything now our first race is 17 days later at the bahrain grand prix until then activities you know we got to do a bit of marketing we're going to do a merchandise sale thing happen for the first few days get a bit of awareness around s2g motorsports um after that i think we'll do something like aero and chassis focus because i want the few upgrades that we're doing based on aero and chassis and that's going to basically fill up all our days Yup, there's nothing else we can do. Yeah, fair enough, fair enough. That's what we'll do to start with. I doubt we're going to get any upgrades soon. But what we can do now, now is a bit of R&D. So because we've kind of set up our preseason activities to give us an aero boost, I think I'm going to see if I can get some aero upgrades to start with. 550 points for front nose. That'll give us decent stuff. Failure chance, 0%. No, 30% failure chance. Okay, that's a tough one. Um, let's do it. 16 days, hopefully it, it, it will be a success. Now, we've still got 450 resource points. We could maybe see if there's anything available for that. I don't think so. I don't think so. What about on the powertrain side? We've got one for 500. Uh, nah, nah, nothing we can use. Maybe durability? Ah, uh, 500 is like the minimum, I guess. So no upgrades for anything else. It's just the aero side where we can get a bit of improvement before the first race in Bahrain. All right, man, let, let's go through the days and just see what happens. I'm just wondering if our front nose is going to be ready for the Bahrain GP. Hopefully it will. Ah, oh, look at 
get this. Of course. Pain, pain, pain. The front nose has failed. We're going to have to put that again on development. Uh, this time it'll happen 100%. But we will get it before the Jeddah Grand Prix. That's good. Seven days we'll have our front nose updated. Meanwhile, I want to maybe do something with the chassis as well since the morale is high. Uh, we could maybe do this. Yeah, let's do the rear floor. 35% uh, failure chance. We'll, we'll still do that because we've got the resource points. And yeah, we just got to keep doing the R&D, man. But no upgrades for the Bahrain GP. It is what it is. But it's now time to get into some racing action. I normally don't do the practice sessions, but since this is a new Formula 1 game, I want to see what the practice sessions are all about, get a bit of time on track, and just figure out how to work this game out, you know? You guys know how bad I am at F1, so yeah, we, we probably need to do this. Hey, no Jeff! It's a new engineer! I won't let you down. All right. The car's ready to go, but it's brand new, of course, so there may be a few issues here and there. We'll be keeping a close eye on all the data. Awesome, awesome. New engineer. All right, so let's see what practice program do we want to do. Uh, Qualifying pace? Yeah, uh, probably. I want to do the qualifying pace one, and let's just see where our car stands, if I can get a good lap in at Bahrain. This will give us a good understanding of how things are going. All right, guys, my first lap of F1 2022. Oh my god, I'm excited. I'm excited. DRS open and the lap begins. This is a quali sim and let's see where we can finish in this quali sim. Pace is there. Complete braking. Oh, that was bad. That was bad for me, but I've kept it on track. I've kept it on track. Lost a bit of time there. Uh, lost a lot of time there. That was bad for me. And then I forgot to open DRS. Absolute carnage for me, man. But it's fine. At least I'm keeping the car on the track. At least I'm keeping the car on the track. That's what matters at, at these first few laps. Bruh. <laughs> pain. Absolute pain. By the way, guys, about flashbacks, I'm allowed to use only three flashbacks during a race, okay? I think that way we'll keep it realistic somehow, and I won't end up spamming flashbacks, okay? So, three flashbacks during the race, I'll get to, to just survive. If I bang off that as well, it's over for me. We're gonna just retire the car. Alright, so that's how we'll do. I think that's gonna be a fair way to run this series. At least for now. Okay, this this quali sim absolute tragedy <laughs> it's been an absolutely tragic sesh for us so far i've learned nothing about the car only thing i've learned is that it's so freaking heavy it feels so heavy to drive yeah yeah this was bad this was real bad estimated position 22nd what an embarrassment we are okay i think i'm gonna try going out on the mediums for a few laps and just see how it is you know just get a feel of the medium tire because that's probably going to be the tire we start the race on all right let's put in some good laps get a bit of mileage in and see how the car feels like on the medium tire that's the goal now we'll use a bit of the overtake mode as well right now on this straight just a little bit just a little bit and then we'll recharge Speed trap of 331 kilometers per hour. Sheesh, that's, that's some pace. That's some pace right there, but my God, is this car moving left and right as crazy as it gets. Oh my God. I'm so bad at this game, honestly. At least I'm able to keep the car on track, but that slide there, nah, that ain't good. I'm just sliding around like a maniac, man. I should have kept traction control on full. I would have probably done a lot better that way. Uh, we're already 3.3 seconds off in our first lap than the Delta. Which ain't good. Which ain't good. Which ain't good. But I'm still figuring out how to make the turns properly in this game. Look, look at me. Uh, it's a miracle this car is still on the track right now. All right, let's hopefully put a good lap in now. We'll again use DRS down the main straight. All right, we got to improve. L let's do it. Yeah, I was a little better on these turns right now. Just a little bit better. Maybe not. Maybe not. But with DRS... Let's see if we can improve in our time. That was a lot better. I took that turn like a champ. I took that really well too. But I took this one really bad. But that's fine. That's fine. Uh oh, I went so freaking wide. No, I'm so bad at this. I'm glad this is just free practice. Honestly, I'm not doing well in these programs at all. 
There you go. There goes our car. There's our front wing gone. First front wing gone of this Grand Prix weekend. Absolute disaster. Uh, just gonna accelerate the repair time. Oh man, oh man. I just want one clean lap on this track. Let's try doing a quali sim. Just one more practice program. I just want to try it out and see how I do. Anyways, here we go on a quali sim lap. Hopefully we can put in a good lap. Come on now. That's probably the best I've taken this turn. But I was too slow on the throttle. That kind of let me down just a little bit. But that's fine. That's fine. A little bit bad there again. Moving in and out. But it's fine. With these cars, you can't take the curbs apparently. And I keep taking the curbs like a moron. I don't know why. Oh my god. They're skidding over there. The tragedy. Oh, the bumps. The bumps. The bumps over there. The bumps over there. But I think it's been much better, this lap. This lap's been much better. I'm getting a feel of the track at Bahrain. So, yeah. It's, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's not as bad as you think. I just took my own line over there. No, 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 no. Oh, I'm going to be spending so much money on car repairs during FP. Retire from session, our first retirement. We're out of FP1. Everybody's probably laughing at us right now. Oh my god. Guys, I'm going to be simming the next uh, couple of practice sessions. Because honestly, it probably makes sense to sim it. Because I don't want to wreck our car uh, doing FP for now. Okay, let let's do this one. 100% success rate. Let's do this one too. Easy. Completed a couple of nice objectives. Oh, rear downforce. We'll do that one as well. Perfect. We should get some good resource points, man, for this. We can probably do this as well. Will that happen? Will that happen? Yes, it does. Perfect. We're done with the qualifying pace objectives. Awesome. And that's another practice session done. Yo, we've been so lucky in the practice sessions, man. We've completed quite a few objectives. And that's FP2 and 3 done. And the car is still in good shape, at least. Got some acclaim. I only got 2%. This guy gets 12%. I don't know. I don't know what's that about. It is now time for qualifying, guys. And I'm actually scared. If we can somehow finish P16 to 18, I'd say that is an enormous stop. All right, guys. It's quality time. We're going to be going on a set of softs to just get a good feel of the... Of the track, we've got 18 minutes. If we can get out of Q1, that would be a dub. Like, honestly, I don't know any kind of, like, car setup because I, I really don't know what's the best one. So, we're, we're just going to rock a set of softs and get out on track and uh, just, just put in a good lap. And let's freaking hope we can get into Q2. If we can get into Q2, that's a gargantuan dub for me. All right, here we go. We're about to just begin our lap and let's see how things go all right that's a good exit i got from that turn should give us some good extra bit of speed and let the lap begin let's see if we can get ourselves into q2 that would be a miracle if i'm being honest but you just never know man if we can get some good exits during these corners might just be possible like that one that was really good man that was really good that's the best exit I've got from those turns. That's going to cost me a bit of time. I forgot to on the DRS at the right time. But we're still getting some really nice exits during this Q3, Q, Q1 lap. I'm still struggling with the car, as you'd expect. But I'm fighting with it. It legit feels like I'm fighting the car. But that wasn't too bad for a first sector, you know. Honestly, that, that genuinely wasn't too bad, as we could maybe get on the... The throttle now, I turn on DRS at the right time this time. And hopefully we can put in a good first sector. Where's the first sector going to end, honestly, man? It's, 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 it's pretty much endless at this point. I thought that turn was flat out, but I just couldn't take it flat out. Anyways, we keep going. We keep going. I have to slow down a bit on the corners. Right now, it isn't too bad. It, it isn't too bad. We're, we're putting in some good laps. Did I say putting in some good laps? It's only one lap. Uh, the chaos has gotten the better of me. Anyways, let's see how this goes. DRS turned on. And we are right now third. What? We just put a 132.7. Are you kidding me? Maybe that's because we're one of the first teams to put a lap in. Yo, that is unreal. Am I going to start third on the grid after that lap? What? Let's get back to the garage and see what's up. We might get into Q2 based on that lap. What just happened there? Sedinio doing what he does best in F1. Okay, we're already down to fifth. I just think we got a lap super early. Well, let's go towards the end of Q. Uh, Q1. 
this is called, and just see where we are. We're dropping down to now 12th. We are beating our teammate right now. I think when it's like five minutes in the clock, we'll go for one final run on a set of new tires. Try and beat our time, because realistically, we're not getting anywhere into Q3. The best we can do is Q2. Might as well use another set of softs and uh, just see what's up. All right, well, let's do another flying lap and try and beat our time and see if we can gain a little bit of advantage. I'm glad I did the practice sessions. I, I got all my stupidity out of the way during the practice sessions. And now we might be able to push for a spot in Q Q2. That'll be insane. Let the car slide. And here we go. We've got a real nice exit. DRS turned on at the right time. And because of that, we're gaining a bit of time as well. Now, this is a corner where I want to, like, break a little bit early because it just, it helps you get on the throttle a lot better as you go through these corners. And that's what ex what I'm doing exactly. And we get another set of DRS here. And I've opened it at the right time as well. We should be able to gain a bit of time during this lap, boys, which is going to be really nice as the car slides around a little bit. But it's fine. It's fine. That was really nice. That was a real nice exit we got there. We gained five tenths on that corner alone. Ooh, this one was bad. This one was real bad, but I've managed to take it pretty well. We keep going. We keep go going. We're gaining four tenths. Oh, track limits, track limits, but I can get it back straight. I lost too much time there. I lost too much time there. Oh my god, we're not going to gain anything. This lap, I completely messed that turn up. We're mudded, boys. We are legit mudded. Honestly, man, all the effort, that one turn has completely ruined it. We're not going to gain anything on a brand new set of soft tires. Oh, I'm fighting with the car now. It's over. We tried, boys. We tried. We tried. We tried. We tried. Ah, uh, this was a bad lap. Well, we're just gonna have to get to the end of Q1 and see where we finish. All right, the session's over. Have we made it into Q2? Let's see. I don't think we have. I don't think we have. I don't think we have. But it is... It is... P21. P21. Honestly, if we would have gained that lap with four tenths, we would have probably finished P16 or 17. Oh my god. At least we beat Latifi. No more practice. Yes. This is the real deal. And it's make Ooh, or break it. Bahrain Grand Prix. Let's go. Charles Leclerc lines up on pole position. And Max Verstappen second, wow. Alright boys, first race. Do I want to go on the hard tires to start with? Well, why do I? St why am I starting in the soft tires? Why do I want to do that? Softs and mediums? I don't know. I think this, this doesn't seem it. Like, I don't want to be starting on the soft tires. Edit strategy. What if I start on the mediums? What if I like start on the mediums? and go long on the mediums. I feel like that could work more in our favor in case there are like safety cars. And at the end, we could be on the soft tires. Guys, call me crazy, but I'm trying my own strategy and let's hope this works. All right, boys, Formula One season's about to begin now. This is it. Let's do this, boys. Hopefully we don't get wheel spin. Lights out and away we go. Overtake mode on just to get a bit of extra speed right now. We are faster than Latifi. I'm going to try and take the inside line here. And hopefully that works. Oh my god, I had to avoid the carnage. It's carnage. We avoided much contact there. But I just got pushed from the back there. Oh my god, what is happening here? What is happening? Okay, we're, we're, we're now P17. Somehow the carnage has helped us out in that instance. You've got to always break so early when you're behind like a car park ahead of you. I just let Ricardo go through. It's fine. It's fine. I just need the race to settle down a little bit and we can maybe do something, you know. Do I go down the inside? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Nah, I messed up. Oscar Piastri, my teammate, got the better of me. No. Oh, Sebastian Vettel's gone wide. Sebastian Vettel's gone wide. I think there was contact there. I think there was contact there. We're now. We're still P17. Okay. We're on the mediums, remember, so our strategy is different to everyone else. That was a good overtake. That was a real nice overtake, showing Lando Norris, who is boss over there. I'm liking the mediums a lot more than the soft tires, you know? Honestly. Oh, Lando Norris got a five-second tire penalty. Ha <laughs> ha! Gonna use overtake mode a little bit down this straight just to defend Norris. Actually, I'll recharge the battery for now. Oh my god, no, 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 no. Don't want anything stupid happening. I think we'll have to just let Lando Norris go through here because... 
I don't have the pace. We might try and go get him down the inside. Ah, uh, he's taking the inside line. He's taking the inside line. Lando, you absolute... Oh, I'm just sliding so freaking much right now, honestly. But we've got through the first lap without much damage. Latifi's right on my back. Since when can he actually race? Boom. Roasted. Ooh, somebody went off track. Somebody went off track, and it's Latifi. Latifi went off track behind me. You'll have to see it. Caution. Um, I think it's green flag. Well, that's how you get the DFI out of the way. Landon Norris is like 2.3 seconds ahead of me, man. I think I got to use overtake mode a bit more on this trade. Just to get some extra speed to defend against Guan Yu Zhou. Because the RS is going to be open from the next lap. I think then this lap I don't need overtake mode for now. I'm able to control the car, to be honest. But it's not good enough there. Not good enough. Guan Yu Zhou gets the better of me there. Can I go down the inside? Oh, that was... A rough one, but he's got me back again. This fighting's only going to let Vettel and uh, the others just get the advantage. Oh my god, he banged into me. I don't think I got damaged there, but I'm sure Vettel would have. Vettel would have got a bit of damage there. Probably need to use overtake mode here to keep these guys behind me. Honestly, guys, even if we finish like P18, P17, I think it's good progress, man. Honestly good bit of progress we just got to keep this up and remember our strategy is different from everyone else i'm just hoping it's the right one you know that's all i can say just hoping it's the right one gonna save overtake mode now my concentration during these turns has been insane my god i just gained uh, i thought i gained a lot on stroll but i really didn't stroll's gonna get me i'll try and break later Oh my god, no! I'm using a flashback there. Stroll, you muppet! Gonna use overtake mode because I want to hold Stroll behind. I'm gonna take the inside line as well. Okay, this time Stroll's not near me. What? I think overtake mode has that much of a difference. Wow. I've used one flashback, by the way, guys. I can only now use two more. All right, we gotta, we gotta stay safe. No more mistakes. Have I made a mistake going on the mediums? honestly feel like it, man. We've just put our best lap yet, which is a good sign. Stroll's gonna get me. Fair enough. Or maybe not. Maybe not. That's how you defend, boys. Yo, Stroll! Gonna cry? I'm gonna use my second flashback. I'm gonna use my second flashback over there. Oh my god. I've just got one more left. I need no incidents for a while now. Please. I left him room. I left him a lot of room. I left him room. Don't you come barging at me like that now. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop it. Get some help. I'm using my final flashback. I'm using my final flashback, boys. I'm using my final flashback. I've used it. Now, if I make a mistake, it's all over. It is genuinely over. We just got to retire the car. I'm not going to fight Stroll down the straights from now. You know what? If he wants his position, he can have it. He can probably have it right here. Yeah, just just go, dude. Just go. You can have it. You can have it, dude. I'm not going to fight you. There's legit no point. We're just going to try and get DRS off him and just pull ourselves along. That's probably the play. Okay, why am I this much faster than him in those instances? Anyways, we do get DRS here. That could be helpful. DRS open. As people are pitting now. People are pitting. That could give us some clean air to run. Okay, another DRS zone over here. Why is Verstappen 14th? I'm pretty sure he must have pitted for that. If we get like a virtual safety car or something, it'll be such a dub. Now Stroll is pitted. We've got clear air. We've just got to focus on ourselves and put some good laps. That's the goal. That is the goal. Put some good laps in this. There's no clear air. There's legit no clear air for us. Oh my god. Yeah, guys. Russell is clear. Perez and Hamilton right behind me. I think I just want to let them through. Just want to let them through. I'm just going to break early. Let Perez through. And we can probably get DRS then. Oh, come on. Perez gets DRS. I don't. Oh, I missed the activation zone then. Yikes, man. And Hamilton gets me as well. That's fine. I don't want to fight this. I don't want to fight this. No. Guys, I'm going to do another flashback. I'm sorry. Four. I'm so confused, guys. What are we supposed to do here in this fight between Perez and Hamilton? 
if we can just keep getting DRS of Sergio Perez, that's a dub. But for how long can I stay behind him is the real question, man. Honestly, I just want to let Hamilton pass. In fact, I just want to pit. I, I really just want to pit, man. Honestly, I just want to pit. Oh my god, here's a fight with Alonso. And now here's a fight with Hamilton gets past me. The duo have gotten past me there. Oh my days. I'm going to go down the inside. Was that an L? Nah, it, it was. We're not going to get DRS or anything. But here we are on Lewis Hamilton. Down the hairpin as also goes Valtteri Bottas. Down the inside. Who's taking on Hamilton as well? We're probably going to get DRS because of all this. And also, this is our final lap of these set of mediums. We're going to be coming in for a set of soft tires. Okay. We push. We push. Got to try and stay in DRS for as long as we can. Why don't we have DRS over here, guys? I'm confused. But okay, we'll just keep pace with them. We'll just keep pace with them. We'll just keep pace with them. I should get DRS down this straight, which is nice. That'll give me a nice speed boost as we head into the pits. We are ninth right now before the pit stop. We needed like a safety car or something to make this strategy work, but that just did not happen, did it? You know, it is what it is, I guess. All right, I'm going to be heading into the pits now. Going to be heading into the pits, and let's hope we can have a good pit stop. And let's just see where we come out. We're in the soft tires, so we're going to be able to attack for the final stint. Five laps on this soft tire. Okay, I need to turn in and do it at the right time. Late. Oh my god. I messed up. Gonna be a late pit stop. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. I come out anyways like 19. This is such an L. My strategy didn't work at all. We've somehow kept track position over Sebastian Vettel and we get DRS to help us out. We're now on extremely fresh soft tires. We gotta make it count, boys. We gotta make this count. How do I keep Sebastian Vettel behind me, man? Honestly, I've got no idea. Gonna use overtake mode. We get a bit of a nice... There's a nice gap between us and Vettel, but he gets DRS. The guy behind him gets DRS as well. Power down slowly. Good bit of corners. That's some nice turning there. We took that one really well. Come on, let's keep this up. Let's keep this up. Overtake mode on this straight. We've now gained quite a bit of time on Vettel, which is a good sign. Power down on the main straight as well. So 3.6 to stroll starting this lap. And let's see where we can be. By the way, guys, Vettel is almost out of the DRS zone. That's what we need. Gonna use overtake mode on this straight a little bit just to get a bit of advantage. I'm gonna start saving it now. By the way, guys, look at how much we've closed the gap between us and Stroll. Maybe we could get Stroll. If we could get Stroll, I'd say it's 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 nice. Like, honestly. It's not bad for our first ever race in F1. So at the end of lap 11. We've closed the gap down to 2.2 seconds versus Stroll. I want to get him in this race. Guys, look at the gap between us and Stroll at the end of this straight. It was 1.1, but now it's 1.5. But we are closing him down by the end of the next lap. I reckon we're going to be in his DRS. We really are. Come on now. Maybe a bit of overtake mode to just get into the DRS on that straight, on the main straight. Come on. It's worked. Overtake mode done. We're not going to use it anymore. We're fighting for P19, boys. Nothing bigger than this. Nothing bigger than this. Come on. DRS open. Let's try and get Stroll. Maybe in his slipstream. Are we going to get the slipstream from that range? I don't know. I think this is a bit too far. But we're going to close up as much as we can to land Stroll. And get Stroll in this next one maybe. We're still there. We're still thereabouts. DRS open. Land Stroll. Lancelot, we're coming for you. I've got way better traction in the corners than Lance. Can I maybe get him here? Nah, nah, nah. Oh, maybe I got him. I think I got him. I got Stroll, but he oh, tagged me. This guy, man. Lance Stroll tagged me there. But it's fine. It's fine. We're going to get him on this straight, boys. We're going to get him on this straight. We're going to get him on this straight. Power down. Overtake mode on. DRS. Let's try and close up as much as we can. Come on. We're going to get Lance Stroll. The battle for P19 is on. Again, we've closed down massively. But we need to stick with him, man. We need to stick with him. That's the real thing. I think I have managed to stick with him a little bit over here. And the gap is just three tenths between me and Lance Stroll. The battle is truly on. I'm going to wait until the back straight to go for an overtake here. DRS, overtake mode on. Let's give it everything now. Let's give it everything. 
Look at how slow our car is, man. We're not getting any advantage. But I'm still going to go down the inside here. And hopefully complete the move like that. But nah, Lance Stroll's just... Okay, wait. We might still be able to make it stick. We might still be able to make it stick. I get DRS here. Come on. I've got the outside line. Gonna break later. Gonna break later. I've left him room. I've left him room. Lance Stroll, don't you come dancing in. And we get P19 in this race. Ah, never been happier. Max Verstappen has already won the race. By the way, we, we did a final lap overtake, boys. But Stroll might get me. Lance Stroll, stop it. No! No! Lance Stroll got me at the end. I'm gonna still go for it, man. I'm gonna go for it. We are fighting right now for P19. Gotta get my elbows out. Gotta get my elbows out. And we're doing just that. We're doing just that. We're giving it everything we've got on this final lap for P freaking 19. And I think we've done enough. We have done enough to get P19. Oh my god. I don't think I'm ever gonna be this happy for a P19. Ever. Honestly. But we're doing it. We're doing it. We are freaking doing it. There you go. It's done. It's done. It is freaking done. The checkered flag is here. P19 is where we finish. My god, what a grind. Max Verstappen winning an F1 race. It is what it is. It's what happens. Where did our teammate finish? Let's see. Oscar Piastri, P16. No points for him. No points for us. Fair enough. But it was a good race. A good race. Oh, red driver of the day. Yo, let's go. All right, so P19. Cedinho's first ever race on F122. I'll catch you guys for the next episode of my team, boys. Hopefully soon. And we'll, we'll keep it going. Next race, I think, is... I don't even know where it is. We'll find out. Jeddah, yes. Catch you all for the next one. Peace.